Reed Liebarger is here to bring us the latest details on Umberto. Yeah, we got a hurricane out there in the Atlantic mm -hmm. right now, and uh, you'd think that we'd be talking about a little bit more. Good news, no local impacts, except we are staying hot, dry, and sunny. This forecast a lot like when Dorian went up the East Coast. We wrapped around the backside of that, got a lot of dry air. Now, unlike Dorian, this storm, it's not as strong, and there's not a rate of an impact anywhere, really, not the Bahamas, not the East Coast. We're further offshore, you're weaker, a Category 1 hurricane, and once you take a look at where this track is going, East. We're not exactly riding up the Atlantic coast, so this might impact Bermuda. Could see some hurricane watches warnings put out there in the next day or two. But again, other than that, we are staying off in the ocean. You got a few more areas to watch down in the tropics, one in the central Atlantic. This has a good chance of developing in the next couple of days, 80%. Then an area down in the Gulf likely won't develop, but going to be a rainmaker for the East Texas coast. Something that we could use with the lack of tropical development. Some moisture moving on shore would be excellent, but we don't have that in our forecast. We are nice and sunny, hot and dry. This September has been well above normal. We're doing that again today up near 81 by 10 a.m. This afternoon, our temperatures area-wide will be in the mid 90s with only a 10% chance for a shower or storm. Dress light, pack some water. More details in your local forecast coming up here in a few minutes.